this may not be just mine. I know I came up with it, um, and then somebody else might have done it somewhere, some time. Um, I've seen so many moves and thought I made up moves, and then uh, watching videos, watching videos, watching videos, and I see something like from the old school Brazil, and I'm like, I didn't make it up. I wasn't the only one. So, <laughs> so it's nice to think you made up a move, but it's like nothing's new, right? Um, so this one is a uh, called rolling heel hook, and it's from De La Hiva. So. I step in here, I do that a lot, and the guy goes De La Hiva. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to step back, and instead of sitting for a knee bar, like you see a lot, I'm going to shoot my hand here, okay? I'm going to bend my knee, and I'm going to roll right here to the heel hook, okay? And uh, just for fun, it's another position I've been working on from the saddle, right? So I've seen this with judo, they come here. And they extend their leg and they come here and I throw their leg over and that hurts but I've also found that he can sit up and he can footlock this foot yeah and if I can't get the heel in time he would win that so what I do is instead of throwing my leg over bring it under and I cross my feet here try to get away <laughs> I call this one the unicorn all right because his legs are intertwined like a unicorn horn and it's kind of like far out there, like you've done a lot of work to get there, so you might seem impossible, but it's not, trust me. So we're here, rolling heel hook. I go here, bend, this keeps everything tight, and then I forward roll, reaping my leg over, and my toe finds, my armpit finds the toes, heel hook, okay? So same heel hook position we've been working on. Then if you want to go saddle, you can go saddle, right? Um, he's fighting to get out of this. What I do is I'll extend my leg, and catch my knee over that ankle. Now I sit up and I crisscross my feet. One, it helps limit the roll with this shin. He can't footlock me and the cross keeps everything locked. I squeeze my knees together and find that heel again. Okay, so it's just a heel hook again. <laughs> Love this. All right, one more time. You okay? Yep. So here, one, two, three. Find the heel, okay, saddle. You want to work the saddle and the unicorn, just go here, and there it is again. Okay, we're just securing, right? He's he's moving too much while we're trying to secure that heel hook. So we go with this. I think I've seen this as called, uh, sorry, this one was called like bobby pin or something, but I found that to be dangerous. So I started hiding my foot, crisscross your feet, lay back for the heel hook. So you have the unicorn heel hook. Okay, one more time. This is tricky to get. So I'm diving my foot deep into that roll, kind of like the rolling toe hold. And I'm also peeling this foot hand over like I was shooting this one, but I go here. Bend that leg, roll reap. Start fishing that saddle as you look for the heel hook, okay? He's still struggling, you haven't got it yet. Go to like try to roll or something. Yeah, I go there. One, two, sit up, finish. Okay, let's practice that. It's the rolling heel hook and the unicorn setup from the saddle. Uh, to the heel hook. On three, one, two, three. Unicorn is not a weapon. Unicorn is a weapon. <laughs>